Pump it up. Pump it, pump it, uh, uh, pump it. Cause it's been a long time Since I didn't hit the water When my barbers keep on snagging my line I feel the current getting stronger As I add up the time Need some distance to cast back behind me Cause it's been a long time Hey, what's up everyone? Today is gonna be an amazing trip. I'm fishing with my brothers. Well, just one brother, the other one is just gonna be floating down the river, but we are all floating down the river. Believe it or not, when my younger brother and I kind of split up due to you know me going to college, during the summertime I came, uh, came home and uh, we went fishing in this creek right here. Uh, this is where I'm gonna meet up my brother and then we gotta take one of our cars. We're gonna go upstream uh, and then we're gonna float down I think it's gonna be like probably a four hour trip. So I don't really know uh, how long it's gonna take to get down here. Cause you know, we, we fishermen, we gotta stop and go and uh, see what we could do. So it might be multiple videos. I don't know, but uh, smallies, all these pan fish, it's gonna be so much fun. We gotta float down with some BFS setup. So let's get to it. So here you are, you got my float right there. Rabbit rider, all right. It's actually pretty cool looking. Uh, I think I can fit everything here, include my big, fat booty and we'll be floating down. I'm gonna talk a little bit about the setup later once I get in the water because I am over a bridge right now. It's kind of a little noisy, but man, it looks beautiful, beautiful. Everything that I expected for my first time doing a river float. This is gonna be fun. So I got my siblings over there, my little brother and my older brother. They're basically prepping everything, pumping things up and now taking stuff to the car and yep, Jimbo's gonna get rigged up and get on the water. All right, folks, I'm gonna jump on in. My brother's jumping on in. We both got life vests on, not just because it's safe. We got pockets. We're gonna put some stuff in there, right? Because real estate here doesn't look too good. But let me get away from here because it's a little too noisy. All right, how should I do this? <laughs> I can't even get on. Let's keep turning around. Uh, there we go. Oh, my butt is wet. And I'm not moving anywhere. I'm going the wrong way. Ugh. Okay, maybe I need to go back up, get up, and get out, eat. All right, um, maybe I can take my bottle and be like, I don't know. <laughs> this is actually very interesting. Very interesting. So um, uh, let's take a look at my phone for a second. Very glad for a waterproof phone. It is 9 a.m. Uh, yeah, I don't know how long this video trip is gonna be. Might have split into multiple files, multiple, tr uh, video episodes but let's see how things go so guys i never envisioned it this way i'm like basically slouching leaning back and um yeah it's gonna be interesting um eye level okay this is i like eye level like when i'm on a kayak i'm sitting pretty high right now i'm just leaning back and yeah it's, it's just so interesting so let me talk about the setup that i'm throwing today i got the corrado bfs reel shimano I got Varivis thin line, this is 10 pounds, uh, braided line. And I got their absolute fluorocarbon leader, seven pounds. I got a snap on and I got a bandle angler, the dark spin, the micro version. And oh gosh, there's a tree over there, hold on. Yo, seriously, how do I dodge the tree, man? Ugh. All right, anyway, let's just cast and retrieve. But yeah, this abandoned angler though is pretty cool. I'm just gonna cast and retrieve because I, I don't know. Like, I don't know what's in the water here. I might downsize a little bit. I do have another reel for some ultra finesse. So we'll see how things are. And I just hit the water behind me casting because like, it's like different. Let's just say it's different. <laughs> I don't know how it's going to be. And uh, yep, I might have put some nice jig and pig for these logs here that I can't even fish in because as you see, I'm just going right by them. So maybe it's actually, not a bad idea, just do like fast swimming lures, just covering water. Like I'm just rotating 360 right now, circles and circles. And uh, if there's a waterfall, man, that would be pretty funny. See if we run into one of those. <laughs> I know, right? All right. I'll just walk through this rabbit area. Hey Dave, those floats look familiar. All right, this looks like a very similar brand, but looks like it has a, a cooler in the middle. Uh, same color pattern, so uh, yeah, I'm a little 
scared going four miles, four and a half miles down the river. It doesn't look too good. Dave, are you afraid? Yeah, sus, very sus, man, very sus. All right, folks, now we are away from the bridge. I gotta say, man, when you go creek fishing, there's nothing else you guys need other than Euro tackle, their soft lock tungsten jig, I got a 1 16th ounce, and their B Vibe swim bait, two inch swim bait. Uh, they have a one and a half. And if you guys want, you can pull, throw the EPF special, which is a one inch swim bait, which I do have. I don't know if I can throw something that small right now, cause you know, it is near the end of summer. Fish are getting a little bigger. So I'm gonna stick with this. Dude, I don't wanna get stabbed by that thing right there. Oh my gosh, the spiders came out. E e uh, 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 uh. Oh. 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 Guys, you probably see the sky right now, but the reason is because I'm going underneath a tree. I'm going underneath a tree. Oh my God, spider web. Uh, 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 uh. This is deep. Dude, this is deep water. Oh, got one. Got one. Slowly. Bouncing at the bottom. That's definitely a trend for today. The They're kissing the bottom. Oh, off he goes. All right. We're gonna fish, fish a little bit of rapids here. Well, at least he cast it. I'm gonna get one cast, but that rapid looks fun. Makes me wanna get right into it. You caught a fish? Oh, nice. Oh no 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 Spiky Spiky Ah get, 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 get. Oh my gosh this is deep oh. oh my gosh I'm not even fishing now because uh, but this is the hot spot guys I gotta be careful oh. Watch I get like one or two fish here Oh I got an idea Clamp! Look, I clamped down. That's how I'm gonna fish for the rest of the day. I'm gonna stay right here. See you guys later, man. Oh, got him, got him, got him! Oh yeah. Wrong side, right? What? Wait a sec, guys. This is not what I'm looking for. But it's multi species. Let's go. Let's go. A sucker. I got a sucker. A chum, creek chum, something, I don't know. Can't see, he won't let me see. Fall fish, fall fish, oh my gosh, look at that. On your taco. Oh, he just freaking croaked at me. All right, let's go. Off you go. Apparently I got water in my dry bag. So much for dry bag. Uh, we'll see if this, these batteries dry up. The trip's not going too well so far. All my batteries are soaked. And then uh, there's another um, boat thing you made, the float right there, that the uh, dual float right there, and there's other floats. It kind of sucks that people are littering after you know their stuff breaks or you know it could be upstream float down. I have no idea, but it's a bad open for us because we got the same brand by best way. No way, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, he's gonna get tackled. Oh man. It's a little too low here. All right, so we have to go right here and we have to get away from that tree branch. This looks fun, very fun. Here we go, you go first. But man, look at the stuff to your, you know, jump in, yeah. Get to the uh, side if you need to. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you're in a deeper spot. You're launch from the, the shallow. That's a good idea. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're going fast. Yo, yo, duck down, duck down, put your, put your rod down. Oh my gosh. I'm actually using my feet to slow down. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You gotta see this? Ah, oh, oh crap. Oh, oh crap. I'm gonna hit it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh yeah, look at my feet. Oh gosh. Yo, this is like bumper car ride. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yo, I don't think we're fishing today. Oh, oh my gosh. We're spinning through these rapids. Ah, I can't see. Oh wait, I can fish here. This is good. This part's good. 
This spot's good. All right, we're safe for a little bit. Let's see if there's any fish right here. It looks good. What I'll do is uh, I'll guess we could probably take out the rope and just tie this thing to our, our side. In fact, you could just untie this, Dave, and only use a few, a few of the loops and use the rope and just tie it to yourself. And it should be good. We can just fish the banks like this, especially with the, the deeper end cuts like that. The swinging lure and oh, I just got hit. Got a small little dinky fish. Don't need that. You know what I'm saying? I check my lure though, because likely it stole my tail. And yes, I was right. It stole my tail. It came up close, huh? Yeah. Yeah, these, your tail is gone. Oh no, it just uh, bounced around. All right, so I got this uh, K Tech look like Easy Shiner from Surinoya. That's what he's using, and he's getting some nice hits too. So I must tr give it a uh, give it a try. I got this from Bait Finesse Empires, and um, yeah, it looks good. Oh, look, you're catching fish with it, slaying. Just walking and fishing at the same time. Oh, got a fish! Look at that. Oh yeah, small E. Yeah, I think what I'll do is that I'm gonna walk down the creek instead of floating, so I can get you guys some catches just like this, you know. I'm gonna tie this thing right to my waist and we're gonna have some fun, man. We'll have some fun. Oh yeah, there's a yeah, hole right there. Interesting. You snap line? Yeah. From what? All right, I got a fish on. Small little smallie right by the tree. Right by the tree. All right. I got it. Oh, had another fish. I think it took my tail. He did not. But there is there's fish over there. I had a fish again. Wow, you guys saw that? I could do some top water fishing now. That'd be pretty fun. Oh, there's a nice tree over there. Nice tree. Oh, got a fish. Wow, this smallie's galore, I think. All right. Oh yeah. Nice smallie. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, off he goes. Man, it's slipping and sliding all over the place. Oh, I got something nice. Something nice all at the bottom. Oh man. It's a nice smallie. <laughs> too much too much drag. This is a very nice spot, Dave. Yeah. Nice get, get, get it over there uh, near the rocks. This is deep. It got some clear water. It slows down. This is like perfect smallies spot right there. Oh, oh man. Let me just pull this fish on this side so you guys can see it. Oh, he's pulling me into the rocks. All right, I just need to get him out. There's a bigger one right underneath me. I just saw something big. The water's so clear. But here's my smallie of the day. <laughs> I know it's small, but this is a small river. But there are some big ones. Hopefully we land some later if I got some uh, batteries to sh uh, showcase it. Off it goes. Never know. Haha, <laughs> <Just dipped it. laughs> nice! Nice. Don't have to deal with it. Yeah, those panfish have a lot of spikes, man. Oh, I uh times like this, all you have to do is downsize, you know, break the, the swim bait in half, and you'd be hooking up left and right, but I'm trying to avoid some of these smaller fish. Oh nice panfish is popping off left and right for him. Got him. Got him. Deep water. It's a sucker fish, I think. Another fall fish, actually. Oh my god! Yo, yo, Smalley's attacking uh, my uh, my fish. It's crazy. A big Smalley down there. I should live line this thing. Catch me a nice big fish. Dude, they have a big mouth. You'll catch one. Just get it near the bottom because I like to be in the bottom. See how yeah, it's like a daze. Yep, daze. Woo! They're here too. Alright, Dave, I trimmed my uh, swim bait. I'll be hooking all of them right now. Hi, 
There we go. See? Ooh. Yep, let them pass. And I got myself another smallie. All right, let's put him back in. Off he goes. Woot woot. All right, folks, a lot of people tell me that you could use a spinning reel for, you know, catch, casting ultralight. But for a small stream like this, look at this. I can reach to the other end if I cast it harder. And that's all you need. That's all you need, man. Don't need no spinning reels for this. Get out of here. There's, there's a good tree coming by. All right, folks, this could be it. Could be a big fish right over there. Or it could be a lot of small fish. We'll find out. Oh, that's a small fish right there. Uh, small mouth bass. I hope that I could unhook him very quick and do like, at least two more casts down there. All right, that's one. Oh, got a fish right there too. Yeah, right next to that tree right here. Could be like a ton of fish. That's another bite right there. Ooh, got him. Small guy, another small guy. Hey Dave, right here. I'm gonna pass it, but there's a lot of fish underneath right there. Right there, you see where I'm at? All right. Uh, don't want you to lose the opportunity, but there's a lot of fish in there, I see a lot. Oh, got another one right there. Yes. Another species, final landing, it is. They could, hey, hold up, hold up guys. This could be a green sunfish hybrid. Not sure, I'm just gonna take a look at it. Uh, get a nice view. And then I'm gonna throw it back in the water and keep casting. That looks like a nice juicy spot. All right, all right. Okay. This looks like a hybrid too. I mean, like green sunfish, but it has like an orange belly right there. Holy crap, this is beautiful. Very beautiful. This is so much fun, folks. I would recommend everyone to give it a shot. Like I could be in here and just fish ultralight all day long. I'm so into this type of fishing. This is my style of fishing, man. Oh man. Uh, what the heck, man? This doesn't look good at all. Guys, this does not look good at all. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. Yeah. Okay. There's a nice boulder here. Water's deep as heck. Uh. 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 I can't get my feet back in. Uh. Oh, got a fish. Uh, very chaotic, but I'm still catching fish, guys. Whew. Chaotic. Chaotic bass. Little noisy, it's like a lot of freaking biker gang. Enjoying a good time out there, just like folks like us enjoying the water. I like they're using the same floats. It's pretty cool. Let's see if I can sit on the edge like this. Right here, it's pretty safe. Oh, got one. It's been a while since I got a fish. Look at the colors. Beautiful. <laughs> Whoop, off he goes. Dude, I'm pretty deep. <laughs> I, oh, got one. Oh. Oh, 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 oh,
Yellow perch. Oh, oh that's a nice one. Oh, Look at the jump. Look at that nice jump. Oh, he's pulling away. He's making me spin. <laughs> he's spinning around. <laughs> 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 he's making me spin. <laughs> that's so funny. Yo. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, he's just spinning around. Look at this. <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. <laughs> oh man. You gotta catch the fish. <laughs> this is the weirdest battle ever. Oh my god, it's so funny. I, I, uh, take this. I guess. This is the weirdest battle ever. Oh, here it goes. Oh my gosh, it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. There you go. You won't spin now, now holding the line. We'll spin together. Here, point the rod to me. I could probably help you. Uh, oh, I just want to make sure he don't pop my, my, my float. Did he get it? That's a nice one. <laughs> it's a small mouth bass. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, unhug it. Put it on the brakes so we can see it. Put on the brakes. Put on the brakes. Good. There it is. Look at that. Oh. Very fun. Here, show right here. Dang, look at that, man. It's great. Oh my gosh. It's a nice one. Woo. Wow. Watch out for the pipe. The pipe is deep, man. They're all in the deep. Oh, yeah. He's pulling line. Oh, my. That's a nice one. Ah, it's very nice. They're in deep pool, man. Oh, man. That's, that's a good one. Everybody <laughs> good circles. Oh, man. There we go. Look at that. Cradle on a Euro tackle. Sir Noya. Dragon. Spirit Fox. There you go, man. That's what I'm talking about. Whoop, whoop. All right. Got him. Beautiful colors. Let's go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Look at his eyes. Eyes is freaking red. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. I'm gonna show it to my brothers while they're eating their wawa. I am still working. Check that out. All right, off you go. Whoop, whoop. Large mouth bass. Wait, wait a second. This is spotty. Whoa, look at that, guys. Largemouth or spotted bass? Let, let me know, guys, in the comments below. Take a quick, close look to the mouth. Mm, see that? You guys leave me a comment below. What do you guys think it is? All right, folks, I've been uh, riding down this creek. There's a lot of people with us, so uh, I'm gonna take a quick break. First session of the fishing trip is completed with just plain old ultralight BFS. I'm gonna put back the Corrado and put a little bit bigger lures on. Uh, and then uh, we'll, we'll see if we can catch some bass and some uh, you know, bigger bass that is because we do have some deeper waters in some of these pockets and uh, I have not hit the bottom. We're going fast and with the Ultralight 1 16th ounce, still haven't hit the bottom. But when I do cast in specific ways and I do hit the bottom, I've been catching a lot of tiny fish. We saw a lot of big fish, big fish. We saw some carp, they're not going to bite. Uh, but I am hoping for a big smiley. So uh, time to prepare my next part, my next video. It's a little noisy, so peace out, guys. Thank you for watching. The fish don't wait. See you guys next time. Cause it's been a long time Since I didn't hit the water When my barbers keep on snagging my line I feel the current getting stronger As I add up the time Need some distance to cast back behind me Cause it's been a long time